What's good, YouTube? It's your boy R. Welcome back to AM Line Advice. Hope you guys are doing good. I'm doing right here. We're back with another reaction video. We're going to be reacting to the top 10 foods that are banned in America. Makes me interested because we got a lot of foodie in the Caribbean, you know, I mean, different fruits, veggies, all type of shit that we eat here. Y'all guys probably don't eat over there. I just want to see what stuff you guys can eat and you guys, like, you guys, like, I, this is surprising me. A lot of Americans don't know about grits. You niggas don't know about grits, man. Listen, if you, nah, everybody from the Caribbean know. I can't say that. I just found a guy in these who don't know about grits. But anyway, alright, let's check into the video. Let's see what's up. Maybe that's why you guys can't get it. Yeah, anyway, let's go. Facts First presents 10 Foods Surprisingly Banned in America. Number one, Mirabelle Plums. Mirabelle plums are first on the list of 10 surprising foods that are banned in the USA. That look good These though. are small, sweet, and yellow plums that originate from Lorraine in France. They are tasty on their own, but can be incorporated into many main dishes and desserts. These plums do not cause any harmful side effects, but are still banned from the USA because of very strict import laws. Wow. Number two, ackee fruit. Hey. Wait, Aki's not banned. Oh, it's the fruit itself. Okay, let me tell you, I know why he can't, y'all can't. You won't get the Aki itself. Because Aki is poisonous once it's not open. And knowing some American, no offense, no offense, no offense. You guys will pick it in and eat it just like that. You know what I mean? That's the national fruit of the Jamaica. Of Jamaica. And the national dish is, I think it's a national fruit. Don't give, okay, don't quote me on that. But I know Aki and Saltfish is a national dish of, the, of Jamaica. I was say of Jamaica. But yeah, though, so Aki, once it busts, that fruit right there is closed right now. So how it is right now in this picture, it's poisonous. It can kill you, all right? Once it's opened up, all the toxin release is good. But personally, I don't like Aki, personally. Aki fruit is considered Jamaica's national fruit. Yeah, it's okay, okay. white red when ripe and has about four sections of flesh with glossy black beads. Why has Jamaica's national fruit been banned in the USA? Studies have shown that this fruit can cause dehydration, severe vomiting, seizures, and even comas. These severe symptoms are the reasons why it is considered illegal to bring ackee fruit into the country. That does not mean you will never get to sample Jamaica's national fruit, though. If you want to get Aki fruit, it is available in canned form in select shops. Yeah. These products have met strict FDA regulations and are considered safe for consumption. Number three, Queen Kong. Oh, yo! What? Kong is illegal in the United States? Yo! I did not know this. Bro, listen. Kong is the best thing ever. It's like a muscle. It's, 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 it's like the cockroach for the sea, let's be honest. Bro, listen. Kong, but if you never had some Kong salad, uh, crack Kong, um, Kong fritter, some peas and rice with some dry pieces of, some peas and grits, my bad. Some, you got peas and rice and dry pieces of Kong, peas and grits. Uh, with, with dry pieces of dry, uh, beet Kong, I should be busting, bro. Kong is illegal. See, that's why y'all ain't know. Y'all, y'all ain't know what y'all missing. That's why y'all gotta come to this side. Come to the Turks and Caicos, and you can get yourself some Kong. And ain't nothing wrong with it. Let me see what he say. Otherwise known as Lobatus gigas, this large Ooh. sea snail comes from the Caribbean islands. It is used in many Asian and Caribbean dishes. Yeah. This is the main ingredient for a wide variety of yeah. soups, stews, yeah. salads, and yeah. even ceviches in these areas. Yeah. It is said to be quite succulent and yeah. adds a distinct flavor to dishes. Yeah. No, the queen conch is not considered poisonous. The reason it made this list is due to overfishing. However, okay. this okay. sea snail is not considered illegal food in all countries. In fact, it is still widely used in dishes in many Asian countries. Number four. Be, wait, listen, on this side, we be busting that shit up, bro. But like he said, okay, he say it ain't nothing wrong with it. It's just that it is, a, it is an endangered because people, people, people is overdo it, bro. You know, everything is moderation. This one be picking up the little baby come so What are you gonna do with that? Well, listen, hey, let me put y'all on game, though. He ain't gonna tell you something, bro. Listen. Fellas, that's for y'all. I put y'all on game. Y'all can't say or never put y'all on game. Listen, when you come to the Turks and Caicos Islands or the Bahamas or any Caribbean country and they give you Kong, 
go to the fisherman and say, listen, give me the pistol. The pistol, right? It's one clear little piece. I don't know if all Congress have it. You say, man, we used to call it Lamy. It's Lamy. Listen, go to them tell them, I want Lamy or the pistol. So basically, it's like a clear gummy worm, right? Um, it's, it's, a, it's a natural Viagra. So listen, you fellas, you come here on vacation with your sweetheart and your little boo boo. You take one piece of Lamy, you eat a piece of Lamy. Sweat. You got you got to eat it right there and there. When you when the freshman take it out of the shell, the shell you just see, he put it in your hand. You got to eat it right there. Eat it right there, bro. Let me tell you something. When you go back to the room, stiff cocky top blood clot. Yo, fire. Hey yo, you can just drop lumbo. You just be drunk. Mm. Aye, aye, aye. <sighs> stiff stiff jokes, boy. Step, not no stiff jokes, but I say stop man. I say stop man. Listen, she listen. She you like, oh, this this what toxic can do to you, boy? Yeah, Bobby, I eat pistol. That's what that is. I eat lamy, boy. What you mean, boy? It's a cake, it's boy. Stop playing. It's an island, boy. Island. Y'all thought y'all thought I was island. Y'all thought I was. Y'all think I need my island vibes? Can't play with me. Yeah. Haggis. Eat pistol. In case you have never tried this dish, it Hello. is Scottish in origin. This pudding is made of the liver, heart, and lungs of oh, sheep. Oh. Other ingredients include suet, oatmeal, and some spices. These are mixed together, stuffed into the sheep's stomach, and then boiled. In case you weren't aware, sheep liver and heart are not the culprits. Sheep lungs, on the other hand, are illegal. If you're looking for a loophole, you could make the dish without the lungs. However, according to food critics, that would alter the taste and texture of the haggis. Number five, oh, that's haggis? Swans. Swans are graceful creatures that are closely related to ducks and geese. They live in temperate climate and are common in the USA. These lovely birds are I've considered never seen an endangered before. species, oh, really? so it's illegal to eat them. In the UK, they are protected by the monarchy, as each one is considered property of the royal family. Wow! Elizabeth has lost her mind. I'm sorry. The queen has officially gone. She owns all geeses. Go geese. Geeses? Geese. Geese. Goose. No, swans. My bad. Swans. So, 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 so is it the plural for swans? Goose and geese. That's more one. So swan. She owns all swans, bro. This woman claim ownership to everything God put on the earth. Nah, 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 she bugging, she bugging. She bugging, she bugging. Pig's blood cake. This Ew. is a Taiwanese street food that is made of pig's blood and rice. Really? It is usually served on a popsicle stick, making it resemble a licorice popsicle. Sorry, is used sorry. In Asian dishes. It adds texture sorry. and richness, according to food of the I don't mess with that. The FDA considers it unsafe, as the method of preparing the dish is said to be unsanitary. Therefore, if you wish to sample this Taiwanese treat, you'll have to travel to Taiwan to enjoy your pig's blood on a stick. Number seven, wild beluga caviar. Caviar is considered one of the staple dishes in elite events and gatherings. Wild beluga caviar comes from the beluga sturgeon, found mostly in the Caspian Sea. Their roe is considered the most prized caviar in the world. Beluga sturgeons take almost 20 years before they reach maturity. Therefore, their row is quite rare and ridiculously expensive. In really? fact, the price of this type of row per kilogram falls into a four to five figure sum, depending on quality. What? The row of the centennial female goes for the highest sum. This type of sturgeon is considered endangered species, and that explains why the U.S. decided to ban importation of this type of caviar in 2005. Wow. Number eight, the original four... Ah! Oh my god, I have so many stories about this for local. Let me hear what he got to say. This shit was bad in the United States, but it wasn't the original one though. The original one, let me tell you, listen, you never had a shitty night unless you drink. Bro, you might be like, oh, I can handle, bro. For local is an energy drink and alcohol, 12% volume in this one can. Bro, that grape used to hit watermelon. I know it's gonna be too fun of watermelon. But grape, this grape right here, Boston. Let me hear what they say. Oh. This is a flavored energy drink. The 
the container ah, alcohol. Ah. It originated in the USA, surprisingly. It contains taurine, guarana, caffeine, as well as a dose of alcohol. Guarana on its own can be quite deadly as it is considered a stimulant that is twice as potent as caffeine. Wow. Four Loco had to change its drink formulation as the FDA considered their drink a health risk. At present, the Four Loco only contains alcohol. Number nine. Ah, uh, that's why they banned it. They banned this while I was in high school. Bro, listen, I remember this girl, right? She, she, she snuck. She snuck some of that into a school on the school campus, right? And she was drinking that shit, bro. She come to our class, right? You know, everybody get their little cup, sip, sip, you know, whatever. Well, not me, not me. I'm, I'm a child of God. But anyhow, so she won't be the big top shot. I thought, oh, I could drink more. So it's like, yo, you want can? She buy her own can. So it's like, yo, my advice, share with somebody because you can't drink all. I can drink this, bro. That y'all freaking shot that whole thing back, right? She come in our class, everybody, she's stopping in front of our door. You good? You good? I got to rock forward. She rock, no, she rock forward. She rock back. She rock forward. And she rock back. Next to that big bitch lean forward. Kaboom! Drop on her face. She ain't even put her hand out. Bash! And I was like, oh shit, this bitch dead. <laughs> <laughs> that was the very first thing. Niggas ran out of the car. So I study. I walk over. I said, bro, you okay? Yeah, I just fucked up, man. <laughs> <laughs> I said, y'all go in your class, boy. You're going to cause us getting trouble for you. Man, I let me. Sumarzu. This is a cheese that originated in Sardinia. It makes the list of 10 surprising foods banned in the USA because it contains live maggots. What? It is made by fermenting pecorino cheese. This process causes maggot infestation, and they help alter the texture of this cheese. Surprisingly, oh my cheese enthusiasts state that it should be considered unsafe to eat if the maggots have died. Therefore, one would have to eat it when the maggots are still alive and wriggle. But you all know what maggots? Maggots is dead flies. I mean, baby flies, lavas. The love of the flag. The presence ah. of maggots is the main reason why it is illegal in the USA. Number 10, Kinder Surprise oh. Eggs. This is considered the most surprising food that is banned in the USA. Why? This used to be a popular treat in the country. Yeah. Children loved Kinder because what child can resist the delicious chocolate shell that houses a surprise toy within? However, despite being able to provide the two things that children love, the treat was banned because it is considered a choking hazard. Please note that children can still enjoy Kinder Surprise Eggs in other countries. Gosh, man. Subscribe for more. Oh my god, is it is always that one special child? I'm gonna say that. I didn't feel that's what hell I just Is that one person? Not, when I mean special, I mean that one person. Man, not, not, I can feel y'all judging me, bro. I don't mean special, special. I mean that, like that one particular individual. Who child slow and actually gonna put the thing in their mouth and start choking? You know, your average child be like, hmm, that's candy. Oh wait, there's something inside this too. Oh shit, this is a car. Let me put it with this car. I ain't gonna put it in my mouth. But you know, that one particular child, oh this is a toy. I'll put it in my mouth. <laughs> and then the freaking mouth, and what's a choking hazard? We're gonna sue the company. You know, take all the bet. You know, Peter pay for Paul and Paul pay for all. Ain't nothing shit. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this video, man. If you guys are new to the channel, man, smash that like button, subscribe, comment down below. We're on the road to 1,000 subscribers. Help your boy get this. Show your boy's mouth. Whatever you say, we get something awesome today. Be happy. Be blessed. And remember, the world is yours. Peace out.